do you love your wife? Yes. Right? Prove it. Like, what's the metric? Give me the number that helps me know, right? Because when you met her, you didn't love her, right? Now you love her, right? Tell me the day the love happened. It's an impossible question, right? But it's not that it doesn't exist. It's that it's much easier to prove over time, right? So all leadership is the same thing. It's about transitions. So if you were to, if you were to go to the gym, right? It's like exercise, right? If you go to the gym, and you work out, and you come back, and you look in the mirror, you will see nothing. And if you go to the gym the next day, and you come back, and you look in the mirror, you will see nothing, right? <laughs> so clearly there's no results, can't be measured, it must not be effective. So we quit, right? Or, if you fundamentally believe that this is the right course of action, and you stick with it, like in a relationship, I bought her flowers, and I wished her a happy birthday, and she doesn't love me. Clearly, I'll give up, you know? That's not what happens. If you, if you believe there's something there, you commit yourself to act, an act of service. You commit yourself to the regime, the exercise. You can screw it up. You can eat chocolate cake one day. You can skip a, skip a day or two, you know? You, 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 it allows for that. But if you stick with it consistently, I'm not exactly sure what day, but I know you'll start getting into shape. I know it. And the same with the relationship. It's not about the events. It's not about intensity. It's about consistency. Right? You go to the dentist twice a year, your teeth will fall out. You have to brush your teeth every day for two minutes. What does brushing your teeth twice a day for two minutes do? Nothing. Unless you do it every day, twice a day, for two minutes. Right? It's the consistency. Going to the gym for nine hours does not get you into shape. Working out every day for 20 minutes gets you into shape.